Yes? I can't hear you. You've muted yourself. You, you have to unmute it. Command M to, to unmute! Right, can you hear me now? Yes. I don't know why that keeps happening. Shame it doesn't work in person. <laughs> oh, ha ha. Grow up. What do you want? Huh? You called me? Yeah, I know that. It's the presumption that I want something I'm questioning. Well, do you? Well, yes, but that's not the point. Make it quick. Working from home still requires some semblance of work. Can you put the heating on, please? Again? Well, you chose downstairs, and with general amenities comes great responsibility. It's just convenient that the bills are still coming from my account, and the sun is shining. Chill out, Icarus. The bedroom's north-facing. I'm getting a vitamin D deficiency trapped up here. Oh, come on. I'll throw you a quid down the stairs if you put the heating back on. I don't need your charity. Thanks. So why bring up the bills? It's not my fault your trial separation coincided with a government-mandated lockdown. Was that all? Oh, well, uh, if you're asking, you could put the kettle on. Mm. <coughs> and so it begins. I was just clearing my throat. Who clears their throat at the end of a sentence? You have to analyse everything. I've been hearing you cough through the ceiling. I, I told you this place had thin walls. Oh, not this again. Thin walls aren't a thing. No, you had to buy cheap and be closer to your grandparents. So I've coughed a few times. I have no other symptoms. Other boyfriends might be gullible, but don't try and pull the wool over my eyes. I see right through your cashmere of deceit. Other boyfriends? Yeah, we've been isolating for a week now. I don't have a cough and you do. Analyse that. I've never cheated on you. Shouldn't you just stand and salute when reciting the adulterous pledge? Oh, and you don't think I hear things through the walls? Yeah, that's right. I hear you talking and laughing. Like you used to before the sound of me eating pissed you off. Friends! Okay, friends and family, not one individual person. Prove it. How? Well, the same way I prove I never cheated on you. <sighs> Look, you've frozen. I can't hear what you're saying. You'll have to log out and log back in again. <coughs> <coughs> That was a waste of a monologue. Well, at least Shakespeare never had to worry about fibre optic broadband. BT or not BT, that is the question. Mind you, he had his own plague to worry about, I suppose. I mean, the Black Death, not, you know, his plagued conscience from his sonnets. <laughs> I mean, we're in lockdown and he's still worried that someone might think you're homophobic. <laughs> Anyone could be listening, Zuckerberg. Nefarious bots, you know, because of the thin walls. I'll go and put the heating on. Thank you. You won't hear from me again. My people will call your people. Yeah. Bye. Right about now. First class delivery, Paul Express, from Mummy. Right, what do I owe you? One pound, please. That's what you've just delivered. Thank you. <coughs> Did she just cough? Mm.